Hey, good morning. So I thought I would share some of my favorite stretches for the neck um, this morning. So if you want to join me, you can find a comfortable seated space. Um, I'm propped up here in my living room on the floor on a block and uh, just take a moment and find a seat. Take a breath. Gazing around the room, taking a moment to orient into your space. Yeah. And we're gonna start by turning the head side to side. So I do I do this in almost all of my classes. And so taking a moment to sit well, to breathe, and to mindfully go side to side. So I'm just slowly turning to one side and seeing how far I can gaze with my eyes, noticing what my shoulders are doing. Maybe one or two more times like this, side to side. I'm gonna bring it back to the center and then up and down, like you're taking your head and shaking it. This very slow or mindful movement going up and down with the chin, with your eyes, and breathing. So how's the breath? Noticing any sensations down the back, the right side, left side. Let's do one or two more there, up and down. Good. And then back to the center. And then we'll take it side to side. So lately I've been calling this, um, like you have water in your ear, right? I'm trying to shake the water out of your ear. So I'm letting my shoulders drop, lifting the heart up, just letting the arms relax, head over one side, and then chin to the chest and ear to the other shoulder. And then I just kind of hang there. You can like shake the water out. And then doing that again. So side to side. And breathe. You can pause on either side. So sometimes I hang out and I make little movements. Sometimes I pause at the center. And sometimes I add some external load. So taking one arm up and over, adding that weight of the arm to let, to let everything go. So see if that feels useful. And taking your time in that transition from side to side. So I'm gonna do the other side, adding that arm. Breathing. Releasing that arm, bringing it back down to the center. So here I'm just letting my head hang heavy and making little movements side to side. And we'll pick the head up and kind of any movement around there. And then I'm going to move right into swimming through the shoulders because it's all connected. You guys see little Smitty, Smitty's head poking out over there. So swimming, one at a time, both at the same time, forwards, backwards, any of that movement, speed-wise, slow, fast, maintaining breath, right? And then still having that freedom to move around the head and the neck, right? And I'm gonna do like this little cat and cow with the shoulders. I'm gonna draw my shoulders back, kind of squeezing the shoulder blades, sticking the sternum out, and then rounding through the back, and maybe even taking the hands and the arms forward. So I'm drawing my elbows back. You can even open up the throat, gazing forward, and then we're gonna round. So it is gonna be like a little seated cat-cow, starting from the upper thoracic spine area of the neck. And then any wiggling and rolling through the
the shoulders, through the head. You can shake it out, up and down. Take a nice deep breath. Find some length in the neck. And then again, going side to side, seeing what you notice. Okay. To the center, up and down. And then side to side, ear to shoulder, chin to chest, ear to shoulder. Breathe. Okay. And we'll start to bring it back to the center, lifting the chin, rolling the shoulders, shaking out the head. Take another nice deep breath here. Yeah. Thank you for joining me for our little pause and moving around the neck and a little bit of the shoulders and maybe sprinkling some of that same movement in throughout the day. Um, so thank, thank you for joining me. Have a wonderful day.